difficult to live, especially when you have a family, you know, with with uh, with art. So that's why I have another job. Well, uh, it's important to sell because you've got a lot of expenses, you know, when it comes to sculpture and particularly ceramics, you know. In art, the, the important thing is not something beautiful, but something good, you know? The philosophy of art is, if it's something beautiful, it, it won't last long. If it's something good, it will last forever, you know? That's, that's a good philosophy. And what an artist really feels he should do, he should do. You know, if, if you go freelance, you have, to, you have to do works which the people like. So then you're going to something beautiful, not something good, you know, that's, that's the, the whole thing about it. When you commission something, there are, there are always restrictions. They don't leave you uh, certain freedom, you know, they restrict you. Oh, I wouldn't go commercial myself. I wouldn't accept it. regards my art I like I like mostly expressionism expression is to express myself in art the gestures you know the the, the model itself the face uh, everything you know it, it's a whole it's a whole process rather This is one of my latest works. Uh, it's done with uh, high-fired stoneware, uh, clay. Um, the problem with standing figures, you know, in ceramics is you have to uh, plan, plan how you're going to structure them because uh, you cannot naturally do it erect. So you have to plan before. This, this is the, in fact, this is the original 
drawing from a live class, from the live model here. So uh, <coughs> what I was planning to do is just start with the, you know, start start with the with the legs here, the feet, right? The torso continue over here, so that so that when I when I have the final figure, this will be bonded onto this with either iron rods, and the skirt would cover would cover everything right here. So there's a whole planning process, you know, before you do it, especially for the torso where you have quite quite a mess of clay. This this has to be this has to be hollow, right? And you can notice also certain features which are typical of my style, you know, the, the eyes and the, the way you press is also interesting, you know, with clay. You've got you've got the fingerprints on, on, on every piece of you, you know. So get, getting getting certain, you know, pressure or putting some pressure gets also the anatomy of the figure. So that's that's very interesting in modeling, you know. So maybe I'll take the piece uh, to the kin, right? For me, art it's a it's a great inspiration and a great passion for me. You know, it's, it's uh, when I go down here, I'm I'm, uh, I'm totally you know I totally forget everything you know work and and everything and I concentrate on what I you know uh, what I have to do you know rather than other things you know so so it's 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 like a temple you know for me uh, for every artist you know the studio is a temple. That is, that is also why I don't like no one to come here and, you know, change things or maybe clean or, or do anything, you know, it's a, a studio has to be for the artist and no one should intrude, you know. The,
what, what I am looking for is uh, retirement, you know, at, at, at my age now. So that would give me more time for, for art. So something I'm, I'm looking forward to in the future also, in the near future also. Mm -hmm.